good day, dude. Slaughter to Prevail dropped a brand new song called Viking, and Slaughter to Prevail is one of those bands where you kind of know what to expect. They're gonna give us that unsettling sound, you know, the one that sounds like a damn hell beast is getting stabbed in the throat by a switchblade. That sound. When I listen to a new Slaughter to Prevail song, oh, it's good. I, I don't know what's tingling down here or what I'm fondling but something's getting fondled. It's gonna be my fucking skull! You ready to feel uncomfortable, but badass to the point where you can bench press your fridge? Me too. Let's get it, man! I'm kinda nervous, dude. Let's go. It makes me feel like I'm riding horseback on a damn black stallion. It literally makes me feel like I'm riding in a battle and it's got like the... Y'all heard The Who? That band with the fucking Mongolian throat singing? That's exactly what this sounds like. I mean, not exactly, but... <laughs> Seriously though, listening to this song, it makes me want to see them live in concert because I feel like that energy would be unparalleled. You can't get that type of energy from every band. And it makes me want to be in a mosh pit. To this day, I've listened to metal almost every day for five plus years, and I have yet to be in a mosh pit. I got such a pencil neck, somebody would be like, Woo! And then I just, oh god! <laughs> I don't know how good that would be for me, to be honest. But this is fun! It's terrifying, but it's fun. It's the same sensation of watching a true crime show. You're like, oh, I'm scared and unsettled, but I'm so intrigued that I have to keep watching. Y'all got these lyrics pulled up too? It hits different. This 
music video is great. First of all, the song is so energetic and chaotic. It just, it, it fills you with a ton of energy. Second thing that makes me think of is I, I wish I was friends with Alex Terrible because I feel like just walking down the street with them, I feel protected. Who's gonna fuck with me if I got Alex Terrible right by me? It <laughs> makes me feel like a dainty little woman and I'm just being protected by this fucking beast of a man. And also, this video does a lot because it's, it's really cool that it like, showing all these really wholesome moments with their fans and these this younger audience and people having a good time, it really showcases that other side of the spectrum that we don't see a lot with this type of music, right? Very well done. <laughs> Wow! Can we acknowledge the fact that for the majority of my metal listening life, a song like this would normally terrify me? You know, gr you know, years ago. And now I'm watching this, I'm just filled with happiness and smiles. This is the song that gives me the warm fuzzy feeling. I'm not trying to listen to damn Unwritten by Natasha Bedingfield anymore. Feel the rain on your skin. I'm jamming this shit! <laughs> Alex Terrible, I feel I can identify with him because I feel like we're the same person. The only difference is I would need to take horse steroids. Not that he's doing anything. He's just a fucking masculine ass man. I would need to do that to get to that level. It's like if I ate myself, I consumed another Alex Hefner, I would be Alex Terrible. And took a bunch of TRT and just pff, fucking puffed out my goddamn beard. <laughs> It's songs like this that make me realize how far I've come, how far we've come as a channel. And I just want to say thank you guys so much for the continued support, the love, and everything you've shown me. And guys, keep dropping them suggestions and we'll keep knocking them out. With all that being said, I'll see you, you beautiful bastard, in the next one. And Alex, if you're watching this, can we be friends? That's all. Love you guys. Peace! Don't